It's Kat. Welcome back to the channel, guys. So today we're going to be talking to Sergeant Muldoon to see what our next little quest is. I think we're going to go... What's closer to us? Cyclops. That's some great audio right there. But their leader, General Achilles, proclaimed an edict outlawing all things with more eyes than he and forced all residents out of their homes. I've started noticing some of the audio in the game is like this, where it literally doesn't have um, any voice lines, and then it just comes back in like a section later. It's kind of weird. I don't know if it's a glitch, or if it's just that they don't actually have voice lines there. It's strange. Achilles always seemed an honorable fella, without insecurities about his ocular limitations. No idea what could have changed his mind. Ocular. <laughs> All right, so we have to find... Wait, I only wanted the other quest. How dare he? We're going to Cyclops Lane. Here we go. So he's got to enter over here because it's closer. Because Firecat Alley is all the way at the bottom. So through oh, here. Good. Professor Drake sent me another assistant. Hurry, this way. We can talk safely over here. Where are we going? Why are you running? Oh, he just disappeared. These trolls are pretty cool looking now, though. With um the updated animations to them. Their eyes are a little creepy, but overall they're pretty cool. He must be here in the, um, what is this, like the park? Yeah, festival park. Nolan, Nolan, Nolan. Nolan in sight. There. Much better. Hopefully you're more useful than my other assistants. Lazy layabouts just run off. Uh, I think he's throwing a little bit of shade, but, but that's okay. We like shade in this house. We like a little bit of tea. Let's knock the sense back into these beasts ourselves, yes? That will certainly earn us some extra credit. You go battle trolls and I'll handle the war horns. I feel like he gets the easier part of this deal. He gets to just deal with horns and I have to deal with trolls. I think we have our spell deck set up. Look at that. Beautiful. We have so many spells at our disposal. Nothing shall stop us. I'm going to join your battle, bro. Don't mind me. That's cute. They have the black cat for the death skull. It's pretty cute. That's a lot of damage. Oh, look at that little glitch through. Yeah, the statue just kind of glitched it out. Oh well. Need one more. Probably my favorite part about here um, at Cyclops Lane is that they've updated the buildings a lot. They have a lot more detail and they have a really cool feature now. If you look closely at some of the walls, you can see the eyeballs and there's like actual eyeballs in the walls that move. There's one. Yeah, it like blinks, it turns. It's kind of really cool, but kind of creepy that Cyclops Lane has just eyeballs stuck in the wall. Like, I don't know if I want to be stared at that much, bro. <laughs> look at this wombo with combo combo. Insta-kill. Now we go back you to Nolan. You're not as easy to capture as other students were. I guess we know what happened to those lazy layabouts this guy was talking about. What? The trolls summoned to defeat the Cyclopses have joined up with them and captured my student assistants? What did you do? Never mind, never mind. This is no time for recriminations. That will come later. This is exactly how I picture a storm student from um, Drake turning out. So bossy and spiteful. Blaming it all on me. I think our best course of action is to tell a grown up. He is really a teacher's pet. I gotta I gotta put in the good words for him and go get uh Drake. Really a teacher's pet. Okay, Drake is probably in his school because he does nothing. Which would be this way. And Drake. Drake. Cyrus Drake. Hello, Ivan. He's an eyeball just like Cyclops Lane. Yes, yes. Trouble on Cyclops Lane. Something, something, students. Oh, you're one of those fast talkers, aren't you? Lovely. He will give you an item of great importance. Bring it back to me. All right, time to run some errands. Talk to Victor Darkwood in the S Wizard City Rope Shop. What's he gonna do? Give me a special robe that lets me kill the trolls? I mean, that's, that is a possibility in this world, that we get a robe that kills trolls. And robe shop. I don't go here ever. Oh, there it is. 
Get some more mana. Boop. Welcome to Darkwood's Apparel Barrel, where shopping for apparel is more fun than Monkistons in a barrel. Hmm, that's a tongue twister if I've never heard one. Professor Drake sent you, eh? Which one? The mean one or the evil one? Cyrus? Oh, I... He's the mean one. Anyway, here's the old Grumps package. All his laundry clean, pressed, and folded correctly. No matter what he says. If you don't like how it's done, you gotta do it yourself, Mr. Drake. I don't know why I'm calling him Drake. He's okay. Makes him sound fancy. He's the main one after all. Take your stupid clothes, mister. Well, that certainly took you long enough. No doubt Victor folded my robes improperly as well. Take this note to Headmaster Ambrose at once. Oh, so he made the problem. Now he's just going to throw it off on uh, Ambrose. Okay. <laughs> That's funny. And he sends an army of trolls and the trolls don't work. Come on, Ambrose. Tell me what I got to do this time. How do I save the world again? We have to convince him now? This is the commons. Go Gathering away! Oh, that chick. She, she wants my soul. She never leaves me alone. Okay, now we gotta go convince Cyrus to join us and save us from the mess he made. I'm coming back. He thinks he can get rid of me by sending me to his laundry and talk to Ambrose, but he can't. I always return. You're still here? Nolan behaving bravely? I don't believe you. <laughs> You're right. Nolan ain't behaving bravely. Uh, also, make sure young Master Stormgate doesn't get swallowed by his own humongo frog again. <laughs> oh, that's kind of savage. Making fun of a student. And here I thought this guy was like head honcho teacher pet. And he gets made fun of by the teacher for getting eaten by the humongo frog. <laughs> Professor Drake said to tell me not to get eaten. I knew deep down he really cared. Therefore, my first order of business is to have you go fight Cyclopsicles until one tells you where the students are. I feel like he's just making up words at this point. Sla Cyclopsicles. Cyclopsicles. Let's see, we have everything that we can have equipped, equipped. So now we gotta defeat some Cyclops Legionnaires. That should be easy peasy. I don't know how many we gotta defeat. I think it's just as many as it takes, probably. Some of these quests are very vague on how much it takes, which kind of sucks. I wish it was just like, always like, oh, kill three, and then you get it. But like, this just doesn't even have a number. And I don't even get a hard hitting spell after waiting. What is that nonsense? <laughs> we'll go Thunder Snake route, look at that. Plus accuracy of 25. And a perfect cast again. Probably like 145? 104. That, that's not the best, but oh well. I like the um, statue behind him as well, the Cyclops. You can just see it back there. It's holding up like a boulder in the distance. It's really cool. We'll go with lightning bats, because they look cool. Students are in the dark cave. All right, so they're in the dark cave. Now we just gotta find it. So it says the entrance is this way. Really? Oh, there it is. So yeah, we literally just have to run. There's not a portal by it, really. No. The portals are there, there, and there. So there's not really a point going into any of them. And here we are. Ooh, look how spooky it looks. Wait, it looks so cool. You see the little red eyes and the little, like smoke coming out? That's pretty cool looking. Let's go in. Eat me. You have to get us out of here. Those zombie creatures have the talisman to dispel these bubbles. Get it from them, please. Oh, those rotting fodders. I thought they were um talking about the other thing. Oh, they're in the bubble. Hello. You're about a shape standing there. Standing there very awkwardly. He's got like his arms like splayed out like he's trying to balance himself. But look how cool this place is. Look at all the boarded up panels. Um, wow, it actually like shows the roof like some like smoke or whatever. And like maybe fireflies. This has always been one of my favorite caves. I find the darker areas in the game so much cooler. Alright, if you guys enjoyed this video and you want to see me free these poor students next time, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe down below for the next episode. 
拜。